Siapa? Hey, good evening to everyone that's locking this way. This is an open live show. We do this every Tuesday on behalf of myself, DJ Rick. Jogging on our fire queue, look around my side. Where my entertainment team, TGM Radio, we call this the open live show. And people, you know what? We'll find the body signal, you know, we'll find one ourselves. We search far and near. I will dig up on all of the mountains in England. Not very mo- much mountain there, everything flat. But anyway, we'll come up with the baddest right now. The baddest female, she's here inside the studio. Alika Harley is here on set with us. Good evening to you. I like your colors. Good evening. Good evening. Thank you so much. Thank you for having me as well. It has come right off the studio. You know, so. I mean, you know, I'm very, very happy with you. Oh, thank you. I'm happy to be here. Of course. I like that. You know, I'm just like, can you just feel like you're one away? Yeah, I am. I am there. Of course. Yeah, I mean, no. You That's know? why I'm even <laughs> making it more special. Yeah, right. Good evening. What's been going on? What's good? It's been great. It's been a great journey, you know. It's You've been, been working as well. 100%. 100% all You take day off? Do you take like, time off already? No. No, I don't. Actually, If I don't. you follow yourself, uh, if, you were, okay. if you were not yourself and you're following yourself, you probably get tired. I'm like, of course does I this girl not sleep or something? I know. Nothing. So the time when I'm supposed to be sleep, I'm writing it. So she's like, it's yeah. crazy. So you write your own stuff now? I, I think you do but I'm so open to rise though. Yeah, but I think me as a music person, I listen to some of your older stuff. I don't, yeah. I don't know if you write them, but it, it kind of sounds the same. Don't sound the same. Like it, it, it sounds meaning obviously it's you singing, yeah. but the, the structure, the content yeah. didn't sound anyway. You get better. Though I think that's definitely 100, percent and I know exactly what you're saying. I don't even know what you actually listen to, so mm-hmm. that's all crazy. But um, I did go through a stage where, um, uh, so I used to swear really back, back in the day, I used to swear a lot of my music and stuff like that. Mm-hmm. And um, I went through like this whole spiritual thing where I was like, oh my gosh, how do I be a Christian? And do music. And then my best friend actually said to me, you just got to make sure that whatever you're doing is, a, is you still got God in it. You know what I mean? And, and so with that, I got. Drop swearing. Okay, that's and good. Stuff like that. And um, mommy a and Christian. Over the time, my mom's a Christian as well. Yeah. But that's not necessarily the reason I'm a Christian. It's more me, my, me personally. Okay. Me. And um, over time, obviously, I've just gotten better right off. And um, before, I never used to um, really tap into my culture as much because I was living in the UK and I felt like I had to be conform to the sound. And the minute that I um, I realised that I just needed to be me. Yeah. And 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 I started doing music that I wanted to do. Um, it just started working. So that's probably the change that you're hearing. Yes, I for people that's watching and listening right now, um, if you don't know who this girl is, she's been creating storm around the UK, <laughs> around the world. Cause I see her on some from players, I'm like, yes, girlfriend. Yeah. yeah, I like that. But she's been doing lots of things for the last couple of years, and she has created the rules for herself. And uh, the, the the good thing about it, you haven't been burning the bridges, yeah. so and you've been just excelling. Yeah. And one thing I must say before I even forgot to say, it, I just like the way how when you do things. You know, it's like, yeah. I like bringing the next man. Yeah. I like that little something there. Thank you so much. So, could you tell us something about your background? Um, I was born in Jamaica, Kingston 11, Cutburn Pin. I came here when I was five. <laughs> and uh, I've been living in the UK for the whole time. All my family's from Jamaica. Um, that's the only mix I have, just Jamaica. And um, I've been living in the UK for well, over 16 years, 17 years. So, both years. mom and, and dad is Jamaican. Yeah, everyone's Jamaican. So, that's why we get that little rude girl style. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, you get it because I'm born there. Do you know what I mean? So, okay. So, um, so you were actually born in Jamaica? Yeah. That's okay. I, I I don't know if, if it was something, you know, because Jamaica and um, the slangs and trend is quite popular in Lincoln yeah. at the moment. So I don't know if it's something you catch on. So that's why I try to get that out there. So anybody don't know, yeah. he's repping Jamaica. So you don't know. Eh? Yeah, yeah, Jamaica. I mean, I'm repping, I'm repping human beings on, a, on yeah. a whole Caribbean, on a whole. But I am born in Jamaica. And I mean, that's obviously what influences my sound. Definitely. Um, yeah. I see you have um, a few different sides because I, I realize that you have the grimy side as well. Yeah. Um, what which side do you like better? Are you more comfortable with? Um, I like all of them. You like everything. So it depends. I there's not one that I feel more comfortable with either. Um, I just it's just whatever I feel the vibe is at the time. Like I don't really try to conform and feel like I have to write a song like this. Mm. I just go with whatever mood I'm in. So if I'm in love, you get in a love song. Okay. You know I mean, if I feel like the baddest thing, you get a bad tune. You know. Yeah. <laughs> like it's, it, I just kind of go with the flow. So I, I'm I'm kind of thinking what was happening when you done can done. Yeah, no, done. Nah, done. That was a whole vibe at that time. Shout out, music man, time man. I um, like the, this is the time. beat. It's a, it's a, um, it's just a, it's an old school beat, yeah. Obviously. Yeah, he kind of, he kind of gives it that old school, yeah. that old school kick in it. That was so random because it's like we was in the studio, and then I heard it, and it was just like 
I knew you had to you had to ride the beat yeah, a certain way, but it's yeah. nothing that I'd ever done before. And we just kind of went on a mic, and that's when I fell in love with your music. Serious, thank that you so song. much. And it had yeah. that soca feel in it as well, kind yeah. of. You know, it's like I really love that. I came feel. across that song. I was on a site. I think it was on uh, DJ City, downloading some songs. Yeah. And I saw this song, this I see the name Al Kahabi. I didn't really know much about yeah. the music. And I said, let me try it. You know when you download something mm-hmm. in your in your Mac and you auto auto play? Oh. And then hear the dance I'll be jump up and I say, wait, what is a song <laughs> upon this aside here? <laughs> and me hear it and I say, if I me just put it in the playlist same yes. time. Yes. It works. And look, we're here. You see that now? Now oh. today. Of course, look we're at there. Us. Look at us now. <laughs> <Isn't it? That's laughs> so what what are you doing now? At the minute I'm um currently well I've finished my ep it keeps we keep like adding little stuff here and there mm. but it, it is actually finished and it's coming out in september it's going to be called the red room intro yard girl in her britain because i am the yard girl in her britain i'm like oh, i yeah. like i like this new way of where um the the uk because most of the the like your generation mm-hmm. is like a product of the 90s yeah so nineties kid very yeah. much true so everybody's just accepting um jamaica side you're not trying to be uh, no disrespect to britain because I, yeah. I am i am living in britain but i just like how people is embracing the jamaica side yeah. the authentic jamaican side yeah. especially with your music your music is not diluted it doesn't yeah. sound as if um you're trying to put on an accent yeah. it just sounds real so maybe that's why people like it as much yeah because it, it, it's just the real thing yeah, the real, yeah basically the real because um vibes, yeah. With, with your vocal i would say talent like a lot of people try mm-hmm. to sound like a nikki or a Beyonce yeah. or something like that but you try mm-hmm. to keep it real yeah just keep it real. um for true for true i have i have actually made sure i try to do that i can i would say um at the same time i do try to make the balance clear so that it is jamaican but i have lived yeah. in the uk for a very long of time course. so it's like i don't Standard. ever try to water down the two and exactly that um and a lot of people do actually try to water down the accent on purpose so that everyone can understand it but i'm just like yo if a spanish tune comes out and it's a hit we're singing it so yeah just make you know it run. I mean? yeah, i'm course. speaking english i just got an accent on yeah to, to, to be honest you're you're bas- you're basically yeah. uh, a uk you're you're basically more UK than Jamaican, but because your parents is I mean, is um, Jamaican. Wait, one second. I just really have to touch on that. Um, ah, um, yes. Sorry, sorry. I'm gonna have to get to you. I'm so so sorry, but I'm, I'm fine, definitely Jamaican. Um, I know you're you Jamaican. Don't say that to the um the embassy. Um, yeah. don't tell them that I'm more English <laughs> than Jamaican. I know you're Jama- Jamaican, but, but listen to the concept. Like you you spend most of your life in in this country. Facts. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, but because all you was brought up, your parents. Um, an opinion. Your parents, your, your Jamaican, your Jamaican heritage that um, keep you strongly growing into your roots. Nope. <laughs> nope. Nah, shit, I ain't answer nope. Yeah, nope. but like, yep. nope. You see it? Um, okay. Bust to 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 Of course. Yeah. <laughs> it is refreshing. Uh, <laughs> what would you. you say would be um, your most comfortable record that you made that you, you felt fun doing? Comfortable? Ooh. Hmm. Hmm. It might be not done, yeah. <laughs> I, it I, was not why, done. Uh, you know, it I, was not done. That's what's so crazy. We had so much fun. It I just was, looks fun. Yeah, it, it sounds it was, fun. It fun. It everything, whatever you feel when you listen to the song is exactly what was happening. Mm. Wine on the rum, yeah, literally. That, uh, that, that, that is vibe. wicked. That's the vibe that it gives me. I feel like me just want to find somebody that and just wine pan. Yes, yes, yeah. <laughs> yeah, just yeah, yeah. You do that. Your yeah, introduction to music. <laughs> I've seen somewhere that you started um, a young age, um, mm-hmm. roughly about eleven. Yeah. Going on to 12, 12 you had this yeah. a little predicament where mommy didn't want you to go in the studio. Oh, it was my brother, actually. Your brother. It wasn't like he didn't want me. He kept on saying, I'm going to go when you're 12, when you're 12. Well, you know. was it, did you feel that it, it was a good thing that he kept you out of the studio that long? Because um, uh, I always was saying I wanted to go to the studio when I was younger. I definitely feel like it was a good thing. I feel like... Um, me with well, the first time i did go into the studio funnily enough i actually was out of school i was kicked out of school it was a bit bad but um i yeah. went back i went back after ah. <laughs> i was kicked out of school at the time and the facility that I was in they had a studio there and um so i told this guy i got to sing da, 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 and i mm. went and recorded my dad had passed just a little bit before that so the first song i recorded was for my dad and um i like the fact that my brother didn't bring me to the studio because i learned independence so yeah. after then whenever i was asking him for money when I was earning enough money, it was for me to go pee for my studio times here, there, and everywhere. Yeah. I was shooting the videos. I was doing all this stuff when I was really young, and I, I really became independent. You know what I mean? And that that kind of made I, I could do everything great for myself. So anyone that comes and does it for me has to do it amazing and yes. better than I would do it. That is wicked. I mean, so so big up to brother as big well. Up my brother. <laughs> of course. You know, thank you. <laughs> One thing I must say with you, um, I've seen you performed in festivals, a big crowd. But I I like to see when you perform the small crowd of people because yeah. <laughs> the first time I saw you performing I think I was um 
one of them open mic sessions mm-hmm. and I was one of the guys in the back sitting down and the host says Alakaya Hari I didn't know who this girl was but a couple of people performed before mm-hmm. and everybody did them thing but when you come on on the stage <laughs> it's like you bring a whole fire with you there was not a people there there was probably about maybe six or seven people I believe you yeah but the way they perform is like the, the venue full yeah yeah and that's how it should always be that Same brought energy. attention for, especially for me i start looking thank you and when i see that song drop into the it, to my box it kind of bring back a little like oh it was she wow yeah so talk to us about you Good. preparing for a show how do you go about doing that um i make sure that i'm not drinking hella the night before because obviously vocals need to be on point um i pray before i just before i go on all the mm. time even if it's just like everyone else is running somewhere else and it's just me and my manager or it's just me by myself i take that time to make sure that i pray before i go on and um and just warm my voice as well like there's certain different exercises that you can do um and just be prepared and just know that i've got this and i feel like now i've got to a stage where i'm just like i kind of know i'm not gonna have a bad show yeah but it, I might not have the greatest one where I feel like this was the best out of all of them, but I'm, I won't have a bad show. So I just remember that and just go out there and be comfortable. How do you mean? You know? Collabs. Oh, collabs. I don't see you much of the, the collabs to you. What's going on there? Um, For me, it's just that. Um, Let me be really honest. Um, I feel like a lot of the times that can hold you back, trying mm. to, and for so long for me, hold you back, feeling like you want this person in the record. And it can also feel like, it can also... um dishearten you a little bit when that's the person that you hear on the record and you're contacting them and they're doing this sometimes it's not no hard feelings it's just like they're doing this they're doing that and sometimes I just feel like you just focus on yourself do you know what I mean like so I just try to focus on myself and also the other reason is the fact that everyone's on this clout thing so I don't want to do a track and then it's like my man because it does something dumb tomorrow morning <laughs> and then he's ruined <laughs> our whole record so like I don't really rush to do the collab thing and I want it to be right do you know what I mean yeah. the right I like collabs that are like old school like I feel like a lot of people now do it where they put a feature and the feature's just there and that's it you don't even actually hear them on the track anymore yeah. it's just that's it they might as well have just freestyled on the beat and just put it out separately so I like coming together creating something yeah. and taking the listeners on a journey when you bring it guy yeah the real way I mean go down there I know go, go deal with it like what you deal with UK so I talk to you know you know I know, I know, I know. Not even put it on the English <laughs> When you go up on your black god with the real way from from Philly side. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, but hopefully very soon. <laughs> so speaking of yard, like is you signed to any major record label? I've just been signed actually. Is it? Just been signed. Spill the beans. Spill the beans. Yeah. I got signed to Parlophone. Which what was that? Parlophone. Parlophone. Yeah. So that that, that was amazing. Okay, congrats to that. Congratulations. Thank you. I'm over, I'm over to see a lot of a lot of great work coming Definitely. in the near future. Amen. I'm guessing. Yes. Amen. A lot of music video and stuff. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean. Mm. A lot of what yeah. they what they call it these days, sh- short movies. Yeah. There you go. Yeah. Well, they have been calling it that, innit? Yeah. So yeah. Miss still long yard. What's the yard? Um. Wait. I, I want I do want to go down very soon. I do. I Who's do. the producers down there? You think you you more like it? You 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 like to work with? Well, I got Sean Izzo, so <laughs> I mean that that was one that I wanted, wanted to work with, and um, mm. we, we got that done, so that's amazing. Um, who else? Oh, I don't actually know their names. I just know records that they probably produced. Yeah, you who probably know. You probably know the yeah the, the songs they produced, isn't it? They've so, search is not nice. That's what I was gonna say, though. You know, is it? Nice. <laughs> I was actually gonna say, well, I wasn't I, sure I think, that was actually the Francis name of the producer. Pretty, yeah, pretty, pretty decent as well. Fast yeah. still. Yeah, I, I, okay, see, I know the name. I do know the names. I do. Yeah, do. do the names. I do know the names. <laughs> but I was gonna say not nice. But I wasn't sure if it was that was a DJ's name. Okay. Or if yeah, he's, yeah, he's a producer. He does lots of stuff for popcorn and my type. And, he does my, yeah. There you go. You see that gonna, now? The next thing I was going to say to you, I was going to say, whoever produced my time. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. It's your song. Yeah, because it's kind of, yeah, that will work for you. That sound? Definitely. Okay, and um, um, in, in this space over here, which artist you would have really say, like, doing it over for here? you? Yeah. Oh, who's doing it? Other than myself? Yeah, <laughs> other than yourself in this space. Um, okay. Thinking, 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 Ah, uh, sound like a one wall deep. Ding 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 ding. That that sound good. That sound good. No, over here. No, there, yeah. there is people that's doing over here. But you, okay, so, you somebody we, we admire. Like, you feel we like admire. someone's really like shelled this year. No, mm. we, we really admire like their work ethics, the craft, and all of that. Oh, channeling your no, inner sh- human. Um, Give her time. Yes, please. please. You want some golden dust? We can't. So, yeah, because we can't be just quick on it. You know. 
Yeah. <laughs> I give it because they, them say every artist got a, is a fan of somebody else's music. No, I'm a fan of bare people's music, but I, I, you asked me for one. Yeah. Yeah, one so, where you're like doing it, where you're saying in your. I feel like someone that I feel like is um has um in terms of like respect. I like I love the way they've done their craft and how they've put out things. It's Stormzy for me. Yeah. Yeah. Um, like I remember obviously that album that had Blinded by Your Grace on it that was like so unexpected but like obviously I respected it because it's like Christian and all that no, stuff no that, 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 that's some big man game right there yeah. because like he's smart it's mm. just like it's, it's just but it's not just about being smart it's it's. I feel like it was much deeper than that but personally I feel like it was very much you know you don't lose yourself you know what I mean and that's just trying to show I feel like that was not just being smart that was actually just knowing you. it's like you have to do it coming from a spiritual level yeah. I had to do this and he did what he needed to do as a man do you know what I mean and um, so I really I really like the way Stormzy's done his thing I feel like people expected um, that it would have went another way in terms yeah. of even the branding and everything like that but he didn't really have to change himself he just, just kept it real and just be whoever you want to be and zipped it of course. Course. and the next thing's about Stormzy as well he try to keep himself as much out of controversy that's as what I'm possible. trying to say he zips mm. it and out of the social media there you eyes. go there so, you go. Cool. So I respect that. The music talks. Yep. I yeah. see you promoting. Um, not you promoting. I see someone else promoting you being in America. Talk to me about that. Yes, I am. Yeah. What's going on there? I'm gonna. I'm gonna be in New York. It's big show, you know. <laughs> yes. I see that in the park. Actually, I see DJ Roy promoting. Yeah. It. Yes. Irish Jam family. Big them up. You don't big know. Show big show. Big up. Big up. Big up. Don't know. Yeah. I'm really rooting for you in this one because I know w- one thing you're gonna do, people are gonna remember you when you go there because I, I like the energy when you go on the stage. So come on, could you plug that show mm. for us real quick? Amen. Mm. Well, I'm gonna be on Hot 97, guys. See it. Yeah. You know what day is it? I can't actually remember the date right now off the top of my head. Today is it's in yeah. August, right? Well, it's, it's, it's the end of August. I think yeah, it's it's it, yeah, I think it's in the end of August. Maybe the thirtieth, something like that. Yeah. I don't remember she exactly, knows. but if yeah. you're in New York. Check into that one. It's gonna be lit. It's gonna be absolutely lit. The lineup's amazing. One thing, me not say. Listen, in there as well. me not business. That's who else want up on it? Me just want when you go, really? you represent for me. I will, of course. Right? Come on. We have, Come on. We have the flag. I will. Same All the time. All the time. People, we're still uh, locking up with us this evening. This is Alika Harley. She's here with us live on TGM Radio. It's approximately 36 minutes past nine. So what we do with, with everyone that comes to the studio, we normally give them a little, a little relax, a little vibe sitting. Okay. A little sitting, sitting. Okay. So we call this Dragon, what is it Dragon, what you call it? This one is called the freestyle because we ain't paying y'all no money. <laughs> <laughs> you, you gotta do a freestyle. And they wouldn't tell me bars. what beat it is. So. Nah. All yeah. right, so Let's go for the best. I'm gonna I'm gonna spit down a bit. Come on, flop. See what you, what you can do. Can you better not flop. flop. You can't flop. Ready? Yeah. Okay. You have to give me this beat. Can you give me dark? I thought I was gonna go dark. So only keep it. Don't leave the same way. <laughs> okay, okay, we're doing it. Okay, cool. All right, switch it up. Okay. Special treatment, you know. So yeah, let's go. How yeah. yeah. you live, people? Let's go. Yeah. No me is a girl with love food, so me now miss no meal. But me belly me off for work, funny still. Holy heap of tox the body. God bless the cell. Cause I still enough, man, I'm not over the catty. If you love me, I for love it. The talk, you yeah, love the boom pan, I expect stretch to grow. If you love me, I for love it. The two I for love the hip dips, love the stretch marks and all. Yo, girl good, great, well, fine. I'll want a man, but never need get it right. What? Girl good, bless from time. I'll do it myself, not a no. By this time, Ryan said he wanna give me a door of Renaissance, but Ryan ain't really got the funds. Your prayer is Ryan. How about we do a couple number ones? You know, like build a foundation. That girl are different. You ain't about to have me in the station. I be telling you, say if I put your phone down, mommy said put some dog now of the same look or your fear. Moose cat, you wanna clue that people. Ryan said he's outside, it's a bad one. Ryan I'm do my foundation. Okay, now I'm baking. Oh yeah. No, I take long. You I swear I'm changing, yeah. Educate. Girl and your thing full of glow My girl walk out them can't step in at your shows You're well prayed up and you're not for care no Chatty putty girl off you see down and excuse Yo, now for that all tell a girl She for go ahead ya You look good and you clean when you step So enough time you cross and him still not left Now, borrow girl close and make a leg come on and stretch ya Hey, woo! Okay, here, we keep going, we keep going We're still kicking, we're still kicking, we're still kicking yeah. People, yeah. let's go, Alec and Harley, once yeah. more, let's go you want a full Lewis of this, me show off my money maker Worldwide, this when I switch for no brother Top five list, tell them call me in a disc Cause they get no stop, shell and go on with beer things And not any lyricist can deliver it how I do Never boast it with it when I only speak in the truth You're my born in a yard and my mother on the fool So I pray we are yours and cut and got you Tell her, girl, send me eight acts so the queen thing dead yeah. Being on the end, playing the thing from the set yeah. Could do the... Ah, ah, ah. It's a vibe. Oh my gosh. It's a vibe, people. 
survive. It's okay, it's okay for Friday. Hey, you know what? We're not stop. We're, we're, yeah. we're going again? Back. Yeah. Let's go. You want a full dose of this? Me show off my money maker. Worldwide, this when I switch for no bread. Top five list, tell them call me in a disc. Cause the girl has stopped shell on. Go on with beer thing. And not any lyricist can deliver it. How I do? Never boast it with it when I only speak in the truth. You're my born in a yard. I'm a mother on a fool. So I put you with your yours and cut and got you. Tell her, girl, send me head up so the queen thing dead. Being on the end, free in the thing from the set back. Couldn't diss me, you dig your grave with a set scratch. One heap of bangers for the summer, that's a big fact. Ali, I like high hot shot Harley. Never flexing no Rolex or no Carti. Being on this thing since outside Barbies. I grew up, been bad, been bad and classy, yo. I just sing a roll, don't you see the glow on? God protect my soul, I will never fall down. Reaching out your powers, cause it's in my loan, nigga. Yeah, girl, I can stand up on a roll and I must stay. If the beat are run, then I must spread this me on a Friday. I walk you on a Monday, cause Saturday is rest day. And I'll probably be busy on a Sunday with my J. No, 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 you can't rest on Saturday. <laughs> <laughs> Are you gonna rest on Saturday? You rest from the um the Friday night into the Saturday morning. Oh Jesus! No, I mean, Wait, you wanna go happy? again? Ooh. Oh, sh- you wanna go again? Huh? Let's go, let's go, let's go, huh? let's go, let's do this! Uh, let's do this! I don't, I don't, I, like okay. really? Okay. okay. Nice okay. to you. Okay. Nice to you. All right, all right, she's there. Right. You know what? Auto my control. Let's go. Hey, hey. I don't even know we're going here. I don't know, we'll go in. I don't know either. Huh? I'm here to go freestyle. I'm here to go freestyle. Jeez. Yeah. Shut down. Yeah. Uh, let's go. I like how you once again. Not you welcome the pandem at. No means say you're welcome in a me flat. Pretty face, but me a ton block. Me did a call on the phone, but you call me like you want sponge up a girl. You can't sponge up for me. I'll be free, but I'm in it. Like hold up, remember when you used to love me? Like hold up, I'm steady reminiscing about when I'm rushing, 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 rushing for your love. Rushing, 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 Hey, they call me seven o'clock on the dot. You know, I'll show you a flex and your friend dropped up. She says she see one girl in the back. I wonder if I do see him, girl. You want, you want, but girl pop off this kid. We was all school like Shirley and Phil. Hold up, remember when he used to love me? Hold up, I'm steady reminiscing about when. Rushing, rushing, rushing. Rushing, rushing, rushing. Rushing for your loving. Rushing for your loving. You know, I want to do the Kyrie thing. <laughs> yeah, that song. You, you know my favorite line. Yeah, surely I'm Phil Party. You know me, East Enders guy. Yeah? East Enders guy. <laughs> you, know, you know the thing. Go. Yeah. <laughs> I feel like I'm here singing to Alika. Huh? Serious? Yeah, I'm gonna get hot a while ago. Uh, you know man. I'm, yeah? I'm over here freezing in the AC. To oh be honest. Jesus! I just bust my little bubble, sir. Mm. Lad. But anyway, <laughs> people, that was a wicked freestyle. Dope. Thank you so much. Yeah, dope, dope. Thank so you remember. So much. People on the Instagram, people on the uh, the Facebook, make sure you, you like and comment, talk the things them right. Mm. Alekai Harley, um, what's next for you? Next, like I said, we oh carnival. Everyone be a carnival. Yeah. I can't tell you where I'm gonna be yet, but um, be a mm. carnival. And carnival is gonna be absolutely shellings, shellings, shellings. EP coming in September. The Red Room intro, Yard Girl in at Britain. It's gonna be amazing. Yeah, You're gonna love can, it. And we can find you at everywhere. Everywhere is Alakai Harley. That's A L I C A I H A R L E Y. It's not Alak. It's not Alicia. Sorry, it's Alakai. <laughs> it's not Alicia. <laughs> Alakai. A-L-I-C-A-I-H-A-R-L-E-Y. Don't worry yourself. When you get big enough, big, big, big. They're not going to know. They're not going to know. They're not going to know. And the good things them, you know. You know the thing go. All you know on live show, the good things them, right? Yeah. Alakai I-L-E. You know the thing go. Alakai Holly, Holly. I can't talk now. Remember that Jamaican, you know what I mean? Jamaican. But my name is Jamaican. I never get a Queen English. Holly, 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 mate. Like a Holly Davis, yeah? You on the ball, mate. There you go. All right. said I want to correct. Lovely chavle. Thank you. All right. You see, you're in our PNP color, bad, bad <laughs> artist. Wow. All right. I don't do none of that. All that I stuff, see. You know. nah. I'm just a musician. I'm just a musician. I'm, I'm joking. No we, politics. We all know. We, we're joking. Musician. Come on. <laughs> thank you guys so much for having me, though, man. No, thank you guys for having me. No, no, she bad. Thank you for coming through. Yes. And uh, it's lovely having you into the studio. Can you just give us a little thank outro? You. I feel little. Uh, the brand new Rush. Just close this segment for us with Rush for me, please. Okay, okay. Yo, it's your girl, Alakai Harley. Stay locked in. This is my brand new single, Rushing.
But you welcome the bond the what? No means say you're welcome in a me flat. Pretty face, but me heart on black. Me did a call on the phone, but you never call on the what? Come in on my flat. Pretty face, but me heart on black. Me did a call on the phone, but you never call, call like you want. Punch up a girl, you can't sponge up a me. I'll be real, but it's loving it free. Like whole life, remember when you used to love me? Like whole life, I'm steady reminiscing. When I was rushing, 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 rushing. She said she's 